Thanks a lot, Rachel. Thanks a lot. Did she just say fuck herself with a cheese grater? Oh my god. Just watched part three of this reunion, okay? And let me just tell you, if you were thinking that you were like over it, right? Or you're ready to forgive anyone, okay? Just, just watch and I swear, boom, you're gonna get shot right back to square one, okay? If you like what you Welcome to the Bravo Breakdown with Jolene. That's me, stand-up comedian and Bravo super fan Jolene Lunzer here to break down all things Bravo. Today we're going to be talking about the reunion leak that Bravo just leaked an hour, maybe two hours ago on social media. It's about seven minutes of part three of the reunions. Bravo gave us a little appetizer, if you will, of what is to come and I'm here for it. So I am going to play it and I'm going to provide a little bit of uh, commentary and comedy. But first, make sure you hit that like. It helps me so much in the algorithm and please comment below as this video goes along. Let me know all your thoughts, hopes, dreams, and opinions about this. All right, everyone, so let's get into it. Let's roast and recap and react to this part three leak what a finale to the finale all right been speaking to everyone in the group except raquel Ew. but now she's here and ready to join us hey ready for this i think so i, I mean no but just gotta always with the smiles jeremiah's like i don't know if you know what's about to happen, but <laughs> it's not gonna be good. So don't smile because I'm wearing a mask, but I'm also not smiling. God, are we really gonna ask Lisa about her Vegas restaurant? I've been there, it's beautiful, it's great. A very overpriced, but if you're a Vanderpump Rules fan, awesome. This is again, you guys, I know this isn't necessarily the most popular opinion, but this is when Lisa should exit stage whatever way you exit because we just don't this scandal has taken over the world we don't need to hear about lisa's business this should have been covered in part one get to the juice get to the meat okay get to the roast beef of it all i can't this mm, all right all right i'm gonna listen i'm gonna listen because i love you lisa but uh trump business going Fantastic. That's great. Yes, we knocked it out of the ballpark. Two hours later. Yeah, it's very productive. It's actually been something of mine that I've always loved to do, create, design. Ooh. I see beauty in everything. Bored now. Let me ask you a question. I thought that I saw some real sisterhood in the car ride to have- Of the traveling wiener. Sisterhood of the traveling boyfriend dong, okay? But she needed to watch Sisterhood of the Traveling Pants, and she watched Sisterhood of the- Tra There's a man right there. He was dating one of your best friends, and you had sex with him for months, maybe years. We'll see what we find out tonight at the reunion, if that is this big secret that you guys have been really having an affair since, you know, you were in utero or something. I don't know. Since the 80s, they've been together, allegedly. But I love that Rachel Raquel, you know, she doesn't give them any credit for actually being there for her at a time when she was probably having a panic attack. And instead, she's just like, and then at dinner, they like questioned something I said. And it was really rude. So I was like, I'll just fuck your boyfriend. That's just what I do. If I'm mad at you, I'm not going to tell you. I'm going to fuck your boyfriend. What did you mean when you said to her, thank God you don't have a I'm man? I was so drunk. <laughs> she, poor Sheena. Sheena has been through it. With the emotions, Sheena has been through it. Sheena's like grasping on that white claw. Sheena looks like she wants to punch out, even though she can't make a fist, you guys. She cannot make a fist, okay? Hello? She cannot, okay? Definitely. If it doesn't fit, you must acquit. She cannot fit her fist in her fist but sheena has been through it she looks like she wants to punch out the windows or push out the windows if you will and tom schwartz calm it down mr taking half a xanax okay because he was just on jackson britney's podcast i'll do a separate breakdown of that in uh, another video very interesting and he was talking about taking more xanax so green light green light what is Tom Sandoval even talking about? Sandy, but what are you talking about? We only took one time. You, we don't believe for one second that you and Rachel Raquel did it. And then you were like, we're taking a break. We're doing a break. Because that's been their thing. They're like, when we were on a break. We were on a break. First of all, you can't be on a break because you were never in a relationship to begin with. She's just your mistress. So she's your side piece. 
and you don't just have sex with the side piece and then you just like let it cool down. And it doesn't make the story any better. These little arbitrary things he decides to add, these lies to somehow absolve himself of guilt are so weird. It's not helping Tom. At this point, it's all out there. Own it, own your shit, be apologetic, atone for your sins change be a better person I, I just i don't get this whole like it does it does this guy is literally an eight-year-old and that is an insult to eight-year-olds because eight-year-olds my niece is eight okay she's gonna be nine and she has, doesn't talk like this she doesn't say oh yes it does 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 this is how he is he treats every woman on the cast when he talks to them like they are his mommy and he is problem child and he's just like, no, I don't want to wash under my pits. They smell fine. Mm, I don't like the smell of cheese under my pits. He, he's so angry. I don't want to take my plate to the dishwasher. You should do it, you bitch. Like, that's how this dude is. While f***ing each other was so demonic. Lala, we weren't f***ing first and foremost. You oh, had making love. I love it. She's like, making love. We weren't effing. Yes, you were. Whether it's one time, 10 times, 20 times, it don't matter that time. We know it's a full-blown affair. Had sex one It doesn't matter if it was one time or a hundred yes, times. Yes, it does, actually, Lala. Yes, it does. You crossed the, the goddamn line. Time, no, it no, it doesn't. Yes, it does. No, it yes, doesn't. It does. James, don't try to make logic out of this. James, like, why does he keep saying one time? It's more than one time. That No one has sex just one time with the mistress. You do it multiple times. Especially if it's a friend you're hanging out with all the time. If it's some chick you just see in another state, and you're not going to see her again, maybe you just do it the one time, okay? Not saying I did it, me, James Kennedy, but maybe I have, okay? But if it's someone that is a part of your life, one of your really good friends, you're going to keep doing it. It does. Yes, it does. Yes, it does. Yes, it does. Yes, it does. No, it doesn't. I can okay. do this all. Day. Um, he is such a freaking child. I love that Ariana met him on his level in this regard because Tom's used to having the, the last word. He's used to having the say. So she's like, I can do this all day. <laughs> oh, he's, so he's happy. Nobody cares. Nobody cares. Break up with your girlfriend if you're not happy. Are you are you his therapist? Are you his new mommy? Because as a friend, first and foremost, as a friend first and foremost isn't that cute because i know i all my friends like all of them just like mm, i'm your friend first and foremost but let's like no no girl i wanted him to be in a situation that made him truly happy oh we want to make him happy it's all about him he's 62 rachel raquel he should know what makes him happy by now okay if he doesn't that's on him i genuinely was coming from a place of do you want to be in this relationship because you can't put genuine <laughs> with this affair you had with your friend, one of your best friends, men. I genuinely was coming from a place of like, okay, do you want to be in the relationship still? Because I can offer you my baby door while you decide. Does that sound good, Tom? Because I rewind. We're going to listen to the cheese grater thing again. But what did this man just say? I love how they're all laughing. This is so ridiculous. Uh, well, Ariana, just we don't live our lives by logic. And Lisa's like, there is no logic to this. Exactly. Ariana, Lisa said. Dude, what are you even talking about? What? Just go shave. What is happening? That's what I'm saying. <laughs> feelings. That's what I'm saying. It's not logic. It's the feelings in my boner. Okay, the tip of my wiener was like this. And so I went like this. God, you guys don't even get it. You're not evolved humans like me. Took over. No, 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 no. I can't. I can't. It's such a joke. There was no logic. He hates them laughing. He's like, we you laughing at? I'm smart. I'm smart. Exactly. That's what I'm saying. Feelings took over. No, 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 no. It's such a joke. Sheena found snacks. Sheena's got snacks. She was like, I got a white claw. I got a little skinny pop. I could stay in this trailer all day. Such a joke. You guys are pathetic. Wait, James and Lala can't talk because. Oh no, she's getting her shaky voice on. Wait, James and Lala can't talk because they had intercourse too. And you didn't tell me. So point, Rachel Raquel. Because they and they kept it a secret until I wasn't this your was best friend. friend. I was 25. I oh no. Lauren from Utah is coming out. I was your best friend, ho. You don't know me. Slow down. You don't know me like that. Uh. 
Move, bitch. Get out the way, bitch. Get out the way. Lauren from Utah is here. Oh my god, Lauren. Give it to her, Lauren. Bro, oh, I wasn't your best friend, ho. You were a nobody. I met you and then I hated you. I mean, oh my god, this is gonna be. Tom Schwartz was right. They, these two are about to get eviscerated. I don't think Rachel Raquel really cares. And I know Tom's handy butt doesn't care. They are just pissed that they didn't get away with pushing a false narrative on Ariana and Katie to get Rachel Raquel and that creepy Joe lady allegedly on the show. Wow. And I also love how James Kennedy is like, every time someone brings up someone from his past, he's like, I was 21. I was 25. What do you expect? Uh, wow. What a leak. Okay, so tonight's episode is going to be an hour and 40 some minutes, I think. Hopefully we don't have to hear too much about the businesses. Let's just get right into the scandal of it all. <gasps> all right, you guys, let me know what you think of this leak. I have to hear from you. And the cheese grater of it all. And Ariana Soprano coming out to play. And Lauren from Utah. And Ariana Soprano could make, like, the best new mafia show. I didn't know I needed. I need, like, a female mafia show from them so even if your opinions are different than mine leave them in the comments i love to hear from you and don't forget to hit that like don't forget to subscribe if you're not already subscribed follow me on social media at jolene lunzer on instagram tiktok and twitter and also at married the number two bravo on instagram where i post exclusively uh bravo content um all right i'll see you guys later tonight and always remember to enjoy yourself it's later than you think bye if you like what you see